Oh my bro. There's a Steve fly hacking in bed wars destroying all the beds. No way. A guy using scaffold in some weird PvP gamma mode. Some random non with 18 quintillion block reach. You have probably heard of these so called hackers. But those aren't the real deal. They only ruin your day for 20 minutes, or however long the game lasts. The real deal are the account hackers who steal everything you have in Skyblock, sell it to some weird Asian Skyblock market, and then move on to their next target. Ruining your day. And many days after. So who are these mysterious hackers? And how much money has been lost to these account stealers? Find out in today's episode. POV. Your name is Lux. You are playing Skyblock, your favorite game. Suddenly. On March 16th. Oh boy. I can't wait to get onto Skyblock. All your stuff is gone. And your coins have been transferred to an alt named Egg Egg. To be sold later to some customer who would like to obtain coins through real life money. The point of no return. Due to this, the guy called Lox decided to quit. Unless. The hacker felt bad about hacking the account so he would return everything he stole before selling it to a buyer. Haha. That would never happen. Oh. Okay never mind. Some people aren't that lucky to have their items returned. Ahhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhh
about 4 billion coins, along with the 1 billion coins obtained from hacking iNerd. Long answer. There's probably a few more billion coins due to trading, but could not be accurately calculated because only the Hypixel staff has access to trade logs. Most likely, there are many others who have gotten their coins transferred through trading, because there is a 50 million coin limit every day. So, let's say 6 or 7 billion coins. So where are all these coins going? They have been transferred in massive quantities to many suspicious accounts. Babri. Check Suchen. Sheridian. Those are only a few of the accounts who have obtained numerous coins through Duinbi and his alt accounts. So basically it looks like an IRL trading setup. With many customers coming to buy hacked coins. You may be wondering. Laugh out loud these are all noobs. Most of these people have strong dragon armor and aren't even that invested in Minecraft. Probably using 12345 for their password. But that was not the case specifically on February 28th. Account stealers impact Skyblock on all social levels. Except the Ender Armor social level because they aren't worth hacking. YouTubers are especially juicy. With popularity comes money. And with money, comes the rich. Hackers want the rich. So when a new Minecraft session ID exploit was discovered, which didn't require you to know the email or password, basically making a super strong password useless, hackers went in hard. Here's how it works. When you log into Minecraft, a session ID is created, which is then used to log on to your favorite server. If your ID is invalid, you may no longer go on to servers until you restart Minecraft for a new ID but, hackers discovered a way to steal your session ID. So basically if you were playing Hypixel Skyblock at the time the exploit was discovered and had a session ID created, you were at risk of getting hijacked. This was fixed quickly, but the damage was done. Iceblades 11 who was hijacked in the middle of slaying dragons and came back to discover the hacker had thrown most of the items in his inventory into the void. Which was worth a few hundred million. Fortunately, no other damage was done. It also apparently happened to HBTV, say right, and time Deo's alt account. That's why it like turns to snow to stone. Dude, yeah, I just, oh my fuck. Dude, I think I'm about to I think I'm getting oh, hacked. No. I think I'm getting hacked. I think I'm getting no. hacked. I think I'm getting I hacked. I just saw it. I think I'm getting hacked. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my wait, god. Wait, your IGN is your IGN is HBTV, HBTV right? HBTV underscore YT. Oh god. <sighs> Hold on, I'm pulling up. Pull oh, oh my god. god. Oh my god. Man, uh, oh my god. HBTV underscore YT. FL2. I'm in. I'm in. Count. I'm in. FL2. No, we. You gotta secure this thing, dude. It say login from another location. What do you do it? Yeah, I don't yeah. think. Just trade it. No, he got no, it. No, no, no. There's people, there's people, there's people. Trade it, trade it. Did you not trade get it? it? Yeah. I didn't get it. Did you no. drop stuff? No, it's a graphical glitch. You still oh, had it. Okay. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just click on the slots. Wait, why did I... I logged in from another location? Dude. Oh, my alt? Dude. Okay. On my right. alt? Alright. Oh, can, we, can we get him in the on call? On my alt? Alright, Skyblock is dead. Dude. <laughs> Yo, what the hell? Okay, okay. If you want to see more info with what happened with Ice Blades, HB TV and Time Dale, check the description. It is unsure if anyone else was affected by this. Or who hacked the accounts. But it only happened in a short period of time and most of the richest people in Skyblock were not logged on when it happened. So how do people stay safe from being skedaddled? A guy called Voxir used to box himself inside a giant cube of obsidian. Why? I don't know. They also stay safe by not giving their account information. Some disable their bank API so they look like they are broke. And also Teresa new security system for Hypixel called Argus. There's also a thing called having a very strong password. But there is another way to protect your personal info on the internet. Just kidding. I am not advertising Dash Lane. Instead, I will be advertising bald splashes. Oh wait. Okay never mind. I guess I will end the video here.